your Big Two Sports. The Big Spring football team did not win a single game last season. That was head coach Mitch McLemore's first year with the Steers and the last for a large group of seniors. Big Two Sports' Aaron Reynolds has our preview on the Steers and their quest to get back into the win column. After a winless season, the Big Spring football team is seeing a lot of changes. The second season with a new head coach, a new style of play, and new jerseys on the field. We lost a big group of seniors, and uh, they did a great job getting us started, getting us rolling, and we're ready to move on, to, you know, and raise the bar a little bit. The Steers are hoping to raise that bar with a new quarterback leading the team. Sophomore Ethan Cortez will take over the offense in place of junior Abel Clark. This is Cortez's first season with the team after moving from Sweetwater. It's been good. I like it. The kids are really accepting me, and I, and I think they really have a real good brotherhood over here. His teammate, senior Andrew Roberts, agrees that the chemistry is better this season compared to last year. We're more disciplined. We are more energetic and a better positive vibe that we've ever had. McLemore says naming starters and solidifying personnel groups is the most important task for the team during fall camp. And as for goals for this season, the Steers are not focused on playoffs or even winning that first game. They just want to win the first play. That's our goal. We want to win one play at a time. That's our focus. We're not worried about playoffs or anything else. We want to win what's in front of us. And like today, we won practice. That's a big deal. Not that making the playoffs should be any concern for the Steers. Big Spring has already received an automatic bid since they're part of a 14 district. The Steers open the season against Greenwood.